Innocent Flesh brings into the light the stories that have inspired the work of the Mary Magdalene Project. Innocent Flesh is a play about young girls and sex trafficking. It is the story of the sad seduction encountered by many young girls who, looking for love, are tricked into a world of violence, fear, and shame, trapped in the life of prostitution. While I was growing up, I saw a lot of this. Some of my friends, they said how they had boyfriends who were 30. I'm 12, their boyfriends are 30. I saw it not just in junior high school, I saw it in high school. I saw it when I taught in the same neighborhood once I was out of college. And I started to realize that this is something that's happening, but a lot of people aren't paying attention to it. The enormity of what's going on, how just a girl walking to school could be approached because she's not getting the care or love or concern at home, and she's completely vulnerable, and the next thing you know, she's in the life. The whole time his eyes are locked on mine and he's smiling at me and I feel like a star. I'm 14 and these men are drooling over me. It's just everybody looking for someone to care about them. Damn. <laughs> Damn. One of the core themes of Innocent Flesh is that these young girls want to be loved. And then later he gives me some weed to smoke, some drinks, and he tells me, but he needs me to make a little bit more money for him tonight. Basically ripping the, the blindfold off of the whole idea of the pretty woman. I have a lot of hopes <laughs> for this. Number one is to really, really make people aware of what's going on and to really pay attention to our children and to see how if you don't, someone else will.